Hello anyone, Mr. Skyson here and welcome back to Hourglass, the puzzle game where time is key and you solve things with a ghost. Last time we solved the first half of the game and felt smart for it, even found the bonus area. Today we solve puzzles in the rain. I love rain. Let's go. And picking up back where we left off last time, I actually had to go through the whole game again because this one doesn't have any sort of save files. I mean, it's a demo. What do you want from it? Fun times, though. It didn't take all that long at all since I knew what to do. Neat thing, though, that I saw when coming back from the bonus area. Because, yeah, I had fun. I did the bonus area. Backside of the portal? Doesn't exist. It's kind of neat. Always found it interesting how graphics can do that. Just be one-sided. Like, you come to this side, you see all the shiny things. Go to the back side. Nothing there. I don't know how that happens. So when we last left off, things took a turn for the dramatic. We got a big rainy level. I like rain. It's peaceful. Love listening to it. Alright, same simple- oh. Wait. Oh. Thank you. E to start recording. Yeah, I was gonna say, I can't just hit that. It's gonna send that off without me. And I don't want that. So, need to start recording. Yeah, I no longer need the portals, I suppose. So that's pretty neat. So do I need to linger around anymore? Do I just poof away? Take me away, me. Bye. Goodbye. <laughs> Leaving my ghost behind, never to be seen again. Ooh, lightning. Neat. I mean, I suppose the lightning would be below us, considering we are in or above the clouds. Where is this place? Ooh, there was some. I suppose it's just all over the place. Ooh. I need you. I need you, too. All right. What are we doing here? Oh, I take you off. You're going to close. You're going to close. There we go, let's try this again. Uh, block pushing puzzles. Shush. I got this. Ooh, something over here. Another way around. Oh, okay. I guess so you don't just lock yourself in there banging your head against the wall. And E. Push the button. Wait a bit. Oh, this is a neat filter. Everything's got the blue outlines and all. That's cool. And back to it. Thanks, me. Thought I'd lost you forever. Guess you can't keep a good ghost down, though. Oh. Oh. One of three. This one may actually be a shorter episode unless I really get stumped on something. A three-way. Oh. Okay. Hmm. Something else going on here. Poosh. You're a platform. I know what to do. Should maybe give me enough time to, uh... Just run forward. Oh no, I overshot. <laughs> ah, man. Alright, gotta wait for this to go away. Thank you. I was worried about not making it on there, and I jumped clear over it. Wait for that. That way I can just step onto it. Yeah, alright. Oh, that is so cool. Look with the trees and all. I like the outline. That's cool. Oh, please. Wow, it's like magic. I stepped on it and it brought me up. And... Ghost powers. Go. Neat. I like this. The whole using yourself to get around like this is cool. Time mechanics. Better than time travel. Much less confusing. Because you can just pass it off as being magic. <laughs> Alright, where are we going now? We got one more to do. Ooh, nice little hallway. Nice little statue. Dramatic lighting. You a time goddess or something. Are we in Zelda? Whoa. Uh -oh. oh, we got stairs. We got buttons. We got the thing. We, 
we got the thing over there. It looks like I can just go straight for it with a little time manipulation. But what are you? And what are you? Did I go the wrong way? Did I pull a sneaky or something? Or do I need that block? And I just don't know it yet. Hmm. Hmm, indeed. Am I going to have to wait here as goes to me? Until I get over there and push the button? Maybe! Oh, this one's a noodle scratcher. Alright then. Uh, am I gonna get back? Oh, there's the issue. I think. Hang on, let me just try pushing the button. Excuse me, me. Push the button. Yeah, that immediately gets that going. Does it come back on its own? It does not. Uh, how am I going to manage that one? Hmm. Alright, so after a few minutes of thinking, I realized I was oversimplifying it. The whole time, I was just trying to do it all in one go, and completely forgetting the fact that I can do this at will. I was trying to use it while forgetting that I could use it, if that makes any sense. So what I need to do, hoping that I do this right, need to give myself time to get over there, use the power again. So, here's to hoping. Get up here. Do, 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 Button. That should take it over there. While I am doing that, I need to go over here and use it again. Me? Uh... Me? How? Oh. Uh... I can only have one ghost active at a time, right. Oh. Nice level of detail on the little model. Do I have a model? My little ghost, it even has facial features. That's neat! Okay, so I think I've got it. Oh, that's gonna take timing. Holy cow. Alright then, I've got this. And go. And button disappear. All right. So once the thing starts moving, that's when I make my new ghost. So wait for it. Go me, go. Oh, that was close. <laughs> Apparently, if you're walking on the thing while it's moving, you go at double speed. And bam. Nicely timed. Now then, if all goes as planned... This may not be the smoothest retrieval, but it's... It's done. Bring it on back. Hey, there we go. And I like that the developers actually did think that through, that people could just jump down there. So they're like, yeah, nah. Wait, yeah, jump down there. Isn't it stairs to get here? How did I get here? I don't remember. Anyway, it looks like I've got to drop it through here, because there's ground below, and that's that place that I was jumping. So hoping I don't lose this. Oh, good. Uh, hope I don't fall. Might reset things. There we go. Now, I need you, but I don't know why. Are you... Are you for this? Because there's stairs. I don't think I can bring you upstairs. Nope. Alright, so you're for this. Why? I haven't a clue. I can just use my ghost cell for this. Hmm. Oh, right, because it's a button press, not a switch or anything. So you need constant depression. Four button. Okay. Do this. Wait for it. Go. Alright. Jump up. And go. Yeah, you only get one shot at this, apparently. Oh. Go me, go, go, go. And I think I made it. Go, little me, go. Oh, there were stairs there. I should have explored that. 
Oh, well. I got a date with an hourglass. Mystic item of time, grant me your power. Okay. Yay. Oh, I can't move. I've only got camera. Now to look over all the work that I've done. I do wonder about that second set of stairs that I missed, though. Time coming, time portal of magic. And there's the one that I came through, I think. Where is this at? No, this is the same portal. Oh, right. I wasn't reactivating the portal. I was just collecting these. For reasons! That will probably come clear in the full game. The door. What's behind? Door number three. Let's find out today. Whoa. Oh. The ending. Thank you for playing. Please support us on Kickstarter. I do believe their Kickstarter has ended now, and they were successfully funded. So good job, developers. And I hope to see good things from this. This was fun. Again, some of the graphics are a little bit soft for my liking. Like a lot of the rocks here in some places, they all sort of bleed together. And I don't know, that doesn't appeal to me personally, but I know some people would like it. Overall, it is very pretty, and I liked the rainy level. Gameplay-wise, yeah, this was definitely fun. I like a nice 3D puzzle game like this, where you're just working with yourself to solve the thing. Just to solve puzzles, because it didn't really feel like I was accomplishing anything other than solving things. There will be a story in the game eventually, but right now it's just solving puzzles, and I like that. But anywho, this has been Hourglass. I hope you've enjoyed watching. If you did, then give the like button a tap. And if you want to see more like this or more from me, then give the subscribe button a big thumbs up. I will see you all next time, and remember to stay groovy.